Hi everyone. Do you want to acquire your CCDE? Are you looking for a mentor? Come on, fasten your seat belt and join me. I will show you the way. So actually, we thought about CCDE technology because I know that a lot of us as a professionals are really busy with at least 40 hours, if not 80 hours a week working. We have our com other commitment in life, families, and sport, and so on. So it's really a little bit tough to find the time and mentor to go for the CCDE. The current recommended list is huge. It includes around 20 books. Most of them are must read. But what about the time? Do you, have, do you really have the time to go through all these books? What about a mentor to show you how to go through this? So we thought about this program. It's considered like a, a mastermind a group of intelligent people, smart people, think alike, who meet every week for at least two hours and we discuss one of the topics in the exam. So we start with routing like OSPF, the famous ISIS, AIGRP, then we go through BGP, MTLS, quality of service and so on. During our CCD technology training, which includes 20 sessions, we'll have a lot of use cases. So as example, we are discussing traffic engineering. So we'll have three or four use cases when to use traffic engineering if you want for a fast reroute. What about another use case to use it for bandwidth allocation from premium treatment and so on. You want to avoid that you go and sit for the exam unprepared. You go and sit for the exam with some gaps. We didn't actually do a lot of hands-on. Yes, for design, you can have hands-on. Hands-on with like panel, peer review, when you have a group of people intelligent like you, where you can start thinking about the best way to design an IPv6 network. Shall I start on the edge or on the core? How shall I do it? What kind of translation is required if it's really required? What about 6PE, 6VP and so on? In addition to these use cases and sample questions similar to the CCDE written, I also give my students and my friends some assignments to do during the week. So as example, following up for traffic engineering, I will tell them, uh, please go and search how we can accomplish traffic engineering in multi-domain environment. What are the options we can use like SDN controllers, like PCE, uh, what about segment routing and so on. So it's really exciting. It uh, provides you with commitment because you are in a group meeting uh, every week. We, are, we have our own uh, way of uh, collaboration like Slack, uh, Cisco WebEx, me, Teams and so on. And also we provide some help and we support each other. If we have any question, you can reach out to me. I'm available and I'll try to give you my experience, which is most more than 20 years. And the good thing is 13 years out of it is in design. So actually, I know how the exam looks like. So we are, we are trying here to do, go and sit for the exam well prepared with a lot of use cases and a lot of actual design discussion and to understand how to analyze requirement and sit with the customer asking the right questions. So, okay, once you sit there, so what also we propose as part of our training is, as I said, you will have the technology itself, explaining the technology, explaining the uh, options you can do to put a specific design for a specific technology. So, what are these options, how to validate it, how to weight it, how to decide what is the best option for the customer, for this specific industry, for this specific customer. And also we have a lot of sample questions. We will have our own room where we can collaborate with other people.